Let's create a demand curve. Let's create a demand curve relating to the demand for houses in Douglas in the Cork area. Okay, the law of demand states that the higher the price, the lesser the quantity demanded, and that the lower the price, the higher the quantity demanded. So how do we represent this visually? Okay, look here. On the visual here we see price on the vertical axis denoted in hundreds of thousands of euros. 500,000, 400,000, 300,000, 200,000 and 100,000. On the horizontal axis we see quantity. This is denoted in hundreds of units. 100, 200, 300, 400 and 500. Right. Take a high price. Take 500,000 euro. At that price, the quantity demand will be low. So at 500,000 euro, there may just be 100 houses demanded. When the price comes down, let's say to 400,000 euro, the quantity demanded will rise to 200 units. As the price comes down to 300,000 euro, you'll see a quantity demand increase to 300 units. As the price comes down again to 200,000 euro, you'll see the quantity demanded rise again to 400 units. And as the price comes down to 100,000 euro, you'll see the quantity demanded rise to 500 units. Now, each of these points represent the quantity demanded of houses in the Douglas area at each price. But put all of those points together and you have a representation of overall demand in the area for those houses. Now that's how you create a demand curve.